So one thing you want to watch for whenever you're buying a new play set is uh, the way that uh, countersink holes, their placement, which countersink holes are really good because what they do is they, they try to uh, bring the threads beneath the surface of, of the wood and that works okay whenever it's in a, in a vertical position. This is in a horizontal position as you can see it works like a cup. Um, th this is how we typically would do our, um, our swing beams is we have a big fender washer which creates a, a large diameter so that when you do um, tighten the swing hangers, which these would be the type of swing hangers that we would use, you know, you have this surface um, on the opposite side and so that's, you, you're tightening that and it gives you this big surface area which uh, doesn't pull through the beam. As you can see, this washer versus this hole is quite a bit of difference. This is probably more like one inch where this is an inch and a half. So whenever it rains, see how the water, you know, it doesn't, you know, it, it hits it and, and washes off. Whereas this is just like a cup, you know, and you fill that thing in, that creates rot uh, around the bolt that causes Anytime you have that type of um, situation, you're going to create corrosion where that, that washer's just sitting in water creating rust, which is going to react with the wood and, and it eventually will go ahead and rot through the whole beam. Food for thought, we'd love to have your business. So look for us, Backyard Fun Factory, and uh, for your next uh, playground. In the meantime, if we're not the right fit for you, then uh, this is something, a tip that you might look for.